Yeah, well, through the miracle of uh, the phone, Chris has, Chris has phoned in. And uh, let me put my headphones on again. That's it. Uh, so what I'm going to do is attempt to remember, after all this time, how to, how to put the phone on the radio. Hang on just a moment. Chris, are you, are you there? I am. So, just speak, carry on talking a little bit. OK, so you can hear me all right? I can hear you through my headphones and the needles are going up and down, so... Um, that means it's all working, so after a year <laughs> off, we haven't forgotten how to do it. Not completely. <laughs> it's so... All, it, yeah, the show's going very well so far, if you think it's only been going for about ten minutes. Uh, I did. I've been listening since ten o'clock to the robot, and then the wheel took over, so thank you. Well, we'll, uh, we'd, we'd, ba basically, we, 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 we struggle on, and um, something happens, and our, our long-suffering audience are uh, uh, listening to something... Yeah. Which and you know I'm very thankful to you. Well, Chris, it's 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 fine. I've I've uh, I. Do you know why I'm thankful to you? Uh, why is it, Chris? You've got me out of ironing. Oh, okay. <laughs> you can iron and listen to the radio, you know. Yeah, maybe well, not yeah, phone in as well. But I can't hold my phone at the same time, oh, so right. that might be a bit of a problem. Right, OK. So uh, I'll come back to the ironing. Yeah, no, that, that, it'll still be there. And anyway, um, when, the, when I was on holiday, I posted a song on Facebook. Yeah. And you said it was too loud. Oh, yes, I remember that. Do you remind me what it's called, Chris? It's called Wees of Beverly Hills. We Wees? Oh, yes, Wees of Beverly Hills. Yeah. No, that was terribly... Well, I think we have to level with the audience that are... This, it is the wild show, but you've managed yeah. to stay wild a lot longer than I have. I think I'm... I, well... Um, country music has, has slipped in somehow, hasn't it? Yeah, but you have been to a heavy metal concert with me. Yes, I have, yes. So you do think guitar music's a mistake? I don't think guitar music's a mistake <laughs> at all. <laughs> uh, no, the, I mean, I, I, the sum of Led Zeppelin I can tolerate, quite, yeah. but they, they got rather loud as well. Yeah, uh, well, let's just, I, I think that heavy metal music's a mistake. You think that? Yeah. Yeah, well, you're agreeing with me now. Yeah. I must be getting a bit old. Well, yes. Um, but it's still called The Wild Show, and I suppose in a way, uh, if we end up playing lots of country music, that would be different for Phonic, wouldn't it? It would be unexpected, possibly, yeah. by some. Yeah. Um, and you... So when is the We Not Know show? Well, we think we now think it's on a Monday between two and four. Okay. So that's our, so, so so. Li well, look, listen between two and four on Monday, and it probably will be there, but it might yeah. have been moved to a Wednesday. But okay. I think it's really just during the the um the crisis. There's all sorts of options being considered. Yeah. Well, Liv, if you turn up on the Monday and someone else is there, you'll know it. A Wednesday. <laughs> that's true. Yes. Well, that's the that's the principle we're going on, Chris, at the moment. I think. Is, and um, uh, how's the studio after all this time? Um, well, it it's looking is looking quite good. There's a completely different robot screen. 
the myriad system, I should say, formally. Oh. But, but we, that's how it will be. I, it's, it's, I don't think it's even artificially intelligent. I think it's following a program. But I it, it think re- you're probably correct. But it's, it's the future, isn't it? I think yeah. radio will go that way, and um, the public uh, have a choice whether they listen to radio in the first place. That's one of the and realities we have to face. Yeah, it is. Um, but I think the public will always listen to radio. They'll get to hear you and me. Exactly. And our esteemed producer, who's probably driving around Exeter, well, he's probably crashed into <laughs> something because he's probably in shock that we're both on the radio. Well, he might be. He might be. He's heading towards yeah. Exmouth as well nowadays, and I, th- I think yeah. they, they've got they've got radio. They've got their own radio in Exmouth. Hold on, I'll have a look where Jay. Yeah, track him down. Track him down on your phone. I can this is do that whilst I'm talking to that, you. That's Hold fantastic. on. fantastic. All right, Chris, you, you, you do that because, um... The uh, girl, I've got to put my speakerphone on. Right. OK, and... I'm not sure this is uh, probably a good idea. It's located... Oh, it's... Located JD and JD is not very far from you. Oh, really? Yes, he might be trying to surprise me. He's in the Guildhall Shopping Centre. Yeah. Oh, yes, look up me, me phone. I've got a message on my phone now. Yeah. Oh, no, that's from it- you. Yeah, it's probably <laughs> saying I tried to ring you. Oh, right, yeah, that's OK. Right, carry on. So, yeah, OK, yeah, he, yeah, so he's up to his usual tricks. He, he's, he, he might turn up before... He's in the guild hall. OK. Whether he can work it out. Are you allowed to... No, 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 you? he can't come in, no. he's He's got to stay oh. away. Because um, okay. at one point during last summer, when we were allowed to move about a bit, um, we could have two people in the studio at a great distance. So, for example, we had we had a cable, didn't we, for for John, and you were on your phone in a corner somewhere. Yeah. And that was that was more or less allowed. But and JD just turned up. He he gave me instructions how to work the phone, which I have remembered. And then he said he was going to phone in just to test whether I could remember how to do it all and then he he was around the corner anyway yeah he's, he's a he's a he pro- he's a produ- he's a very good producer he's yeah, trying to sh- show you something but he's got a backup he plan just in case you fall over anyway yeah i spoke to him last night all oh, right and he seemed okay so that's the main thing settling into it yeah, well, it's a good place. Good place to be. Well, yeah, I think Exeter's much better. Um. Well, yes, it's got Phonic FM. Yeah, exactly. But and the Wild Show it, on the Thursday morning. Between 10 and 12, usually. Yeah. And we also have a Facebook page as well. So you look for Wild Show on Facebook? Yeah, that's the one. Okay. Chris, I want to ask you a question, though, and that is about sound quality. Okay. Because you're talking to us now in a way that's yeah. accepted by radio over a telephone. Yeah. yeah. So you've gone on rather longer than many shows would allow, but that's all right. It is your show. So the Thank quest- you. <laughs> well, you're very welcome. I just wanted to point out that the because we're talking seriously about sound quality, and some people would say, "Well, telephones are all right as long as you cut people off after about two minutes." But um, if we go for this idea of a temporary radio local studio to expand from the Phoenix space, 
what would it be towards the clock tower towards the high street towards um the new swimming pool towards uh well we won't go downhill very much no because you have anything that goes downhill has to come back up at some point well that's true so sound quality it's better on the radio than pre-recording well pre-recording in theory if we had if we had another studio which we might have i think that's one of the things phonic is working on is another studio but if we if we wanted you to be well let's say that that jd is in the is in the guild hall shopping center he's not allowed in yeah. here but if he had a proper microphone he could connect that somehow to a streaming device yeah and the studio could be connected to the internet webby whatever it is and the, the, in, yeah. the internet and the bandwidth would be enough the sound card would be excellent in the studio because that's the other thing you, you know if if um if you bring your phone in here and plug it in well i suppose you would you would argue that the f apple phone has got a good sound card no i wouldn't you wouldn't after after hearing the pre-recorded things the sound quality is crisper on the microphone line and it's probably crisper today because i'm coming through the desk which is a very good sound quality it's an excellent desk it's had no criticism at all over the last 20 years no none none at all so so really what you're saying chris is it's not as simple as it sounds yeah that's correct well it, it is simple the sound quality on any device coming into the desk weakens the quality okay uh, but doing it like this as far as i can tell hold on alexa <laughs> play phonic fm <laughs> oh yeah Okay, yeah. um, Alexa, please be quiet. <laughs> okay, so the quality doing it this way yeah. is considerably higher than it was when I was pre recording, and those Zoom calls that we were dropping in. Yeah. That the quality wasn't the best but it was there yeah people could they sort of follow it there. couldn't they yeah and we were doing other things as well um would you like jd to ring in as well yeah that's a way around it all isn't it okay um i'll phone jd yeah yeah uh, um Okay, when you put, just put the phone down and yeah. push the button to make the, the sure green, the phone... Yeah, the green yeah. one behind me. Yeah, push okay. that and the sound will cut off. Okay. Okay, okay I'll Chris. bring JD. Uh, anyway, thanks for doing this and I'll speak to you soon. Okay, bye for now, Chris. Okay, thanks, Will. Bye. Bye.